What's up you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome my current subscribers and welcome, welcome, welcome newbies. If you guys are new to my channel, Leo, and you enjoy my content, you can ring the little bell and find my soul top. I super duper appreciate you saying, saying, saying. Um, this is um, bonus reading for Sign of Leo for February of 2021. I did get one message as I was meditating on your energy. Um, so let me share it real quick. Um, the message is someone is going to be very jealous of a particular particular leo soon and then i heard right after that right after that i heard it was probably about 10 or 15 seconds after that i heard with especially within the next month so you take it out resonates somebody is about to be particular, um, jealous of one particular leo soon um particularly within the next month so something it sounds like something very positive and something very positive and big is going to happen to at least one particular of you guys within the next month. That's wonderful. Just saying, just saying. Um, that's a wonderful message, just saying. So that's for at least for one of you guys out there. Um, go with your bad self. Oh, crap. Um, don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with you. This is a free general um, bonus reading, so only take the messages that resonate. Spirit messages you have to tell Leo. This can resonate if you have Leo in any aspects of your chart. So you only take the messages that resonate with you as a free um, general reading, my dear. Just saying. Um... So, you know, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ortho, Midhaven, or Jupiter. If you have any, any of those aspects in any of your charts, you take the messages that resonate. So, yeah, so somebody's going to be very jealous. I heard of one particular Leo, especially within the next month. So, something very positive and very good is going to happen to one particular Leo soon. So, that's wonderful. Um, if you wouldn't mind sharing these videos on your social media and on um, word of mouth, I'd super duper appreciate Leo just saying. All right, let me get you some clarifying cards and I'll read it out. In your top five, Leo, we have three major arcanas, three, the devil upright, the moon reverse, the fool upright, and no people. Spirit, can you clarify the devil upright for Leo, please? Eric, can you clarify the devil <clears throat> upright for Leo, please? Spirit, can you clarify the devil upright for Leo, please? Or get another one. Spirit, can you clarify the devil upright for Leo, please? Spirit, can you clarify the six of swords reverse for Leo, please? Get another one. Spirit, can you clarify the Six of Swords reverse for Leo, please? Spirit, can you clarify the Ten of Swords reverse for Leo, please? Can you clarify the moon reversed for Leo, please? Okay, 
before I get another one. Spirit, can you clarify the moon reverse for Leo, please? Someone is working in silence, and it's doing them very, very good. Okay, I heard someone is working in silence, and it's um, doing you very, very good. So that's good, Leo. Spirit, can you clarify the full upright for Leo, please? Okay, like I said, this can resonate if you have Leo aspect aspect in any of your charts. You only take the messages resonate with you. Starting off the beginning of your reading, you have the devil upright, which is um, toxicity in one's life in some type of way. <clears throat> no matter how that is, it's toxicity. Um, any kind of toxicity. It could be drugs, alcohol, um, sex addiction, gambling addiction, narcissism, which is control over people or situations all the damn time. Um, some kind of toxicity. Or you could be dealing with the Capricorn because this is Capricorn energy. You take it and it resonates. Not unsuccessful plans. Some very toxic family of a particular Leo is going to try to come back into their life soon. Some will allow it and some will not. Okay, well, there you go. Whoa. I heard um, some very toxic family of a particular Leo is going to try to come back into their life soon. So, back into the Leo's life. So, they're going to try to come back into your life, Leo. So, very toxic family. Um, I heard for most of you guys, you're not going to allow them to come back into your life. Uh, but maybe it sounds like some of you guys are. So, we have the unsuccessful plans card. So, I think um, that's the toxic family trying to come back into your life and then you not allowing them back into your life. Because it sounds like some of you guys have removed toxic family. Sorry, my son's doing dishes. Sorry. Um, it's okay. Um, some of you guys have had to remove toxic family members in the past. This is exactly what it sounds like. Um, but I heard most of you guys are not going to allow them to come back. So I think that's why we have unsuccessful plans card. Tree affairs with your family. Yeah, so I, I heard um, some toxic family is going to try to come back. Six of Swords reversed, which um, Six of Swords upright is moving to calmer waters, but it's reversed. So not moving to calmer waters or conflict or chaos over a particular person, place, or situation. Dark man, dealings or relationship with a man dark with dark complexion or hair. A particular masculine energy is extremely angry at a particular Leo because they know they have inheritance that they want and they're not going to get it. Wow. Oh, Leo. Okay, I heard a um, particular masculine energy is very particular, uh, is angry at, at one particular Leo because this Leo has you have inheritance or property or money or something of that nature um, that this masculine energy wants um, that you, it sounds like you're in the wheel for it. it. sounds like you're in the wheel for it and you're going to inherit it um, and they want it. So they're pissed at you. Dealings or relationship with a man with dark complexion or hair. So I'm thinking for you got um, for those that this, this resonates with, this person has dark hair or dark complexion of some type. I heard they're pissed at you because you're in the wheel for it. Maybe for some of you guys, you don't even know you're in the wheel for it. But somebody's in the wheel for some kind of money, inheritance, or property. Um, a Leo is. And this masculine energy is pissed at you because they want it. They want what they can't have, basically. Vote, money, or property through an inheritance, winning, or windfall. Yeah, I think it's this money, inheritance, or property that a Leo is, in the, is willed for. And this masculine energy wants it. He is very malicious and greedy. 
but he is going to get his soon. Whoa, I heard he's very malicious and greedy. This masculine energy is over here. Um, but I heard he's going to get his soon. So he sounds like he's going to get some negative karma soon here, Leo. Um, but he's very malicious and greedy and apparently towards you. I heard he's going to get his soon. Ten of Swords Reverse, which is coming out of um, Betrayal. It's, um, ten, of Swords Reverse, uh, ten of Swords Upright is the biggest ass betrayal somebody can do to you. Ten of Swords right in the damn back. But it's reverse so you're finding out about a big ass betrayal or secrets coming out about a big ass betrayal um something of that nature some have already learned secrets of a huge betrayal and are healing from it and some are about to learn secrets of a huge betrayal. And you're about to take control of the situation in a huge way. Wow. Okay, I heard some of you guys have already, um, already know about a betrayal. And you're, moving, you're healing from it. You're moving on. You're healing. And some of you guys are about to learn about a huge-ass betrayal. And you're about to take control, big-ass control of the situation after you learn about the betrayal. Hat, you'll be playing a different role. Some have really proven themselves in a huge way as far as wonderful managers of money. It's really going to pay off soon. Okay. I heard some of you guys <clears throat> have really proved yourselves um, in the money department. You uh, proved that you're wonderful managers of money. Um, and it's about to, it sounds like about to pay off in a huge way. So we have, you will be playing a different role. So I think, um, for some of you guys, I think you're about to be put in a wheel. Um, someone's wheel is exactly what I'm thinking about. You either are about to be, or you have been put in there and you don't know. Maybe that's the secrets coming out for some of you guys, uh, realizing you're being put in this, um, wheel. Um, but I think it's because you're good with money for who this resonates with. I think you're really good with money and you've proven yourself over time and years pro probably. And whoever is putting you in this wheel knows this. They know you're really good with money. And um, they know you will do what you feel in your best interest in a logical, reasonable, cognizant way with the money or property or inheritance or whatever it is. Um, so I think this is someone putting you in a wheel. Or have already put you in a wheel um, because they know you're good with money and good you're good with finances and things like that. That's beautiful. <clears throat> so some of you guys, I think you might find this out. That's what I'm saying. You take it out, resonates. Bo, you were highly thought of. Someone really sees a particular Leo's worth in their growth over the years. They are about to surprise them in a huge, wonderful way. Wow, holy crap, Leo, this is beautiful. The readings have either been really, really great for some signs or really, really it. Um, this is looking great. I heard um, someone has really seen a particular Leo's growth um, and worth over the years and they're about to surprise him in a huge way So I think for some of you guys you're about to get put in somebody's wheel I strongly 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 think that for at least some of you guys just saying but you take it out resonates um, If it's not that it's some other kind of wonderful Good surprise positive surprise. So you take it out resonates. This is beautiful The moon reverse which is secrets being revealed or you could be dealing with the Pisces because this is Pisces energy You take it out resonates, but secrets being revealed temporary situation someone is about to really <clears throat> learn some very important secrets of the past Soulmate energy is really going to help make this happen. 
Soulmate twin flame is what I heard. Wow. Okay. So um, I heard someone's about to learn some very important secrets of the past. Soulmate. I heard soulmate and then I heard twin flame. So I heard soulmate twin flame. So soulmate twin flame energy is going to make this happen. So for some of you guys, it could be in the soulmate, you know, because soulmates can sometimes turn into twin flames, depending on how you make, how you manifest it into your life. So I think for some of you guys, they're coming in as a soulmate energy, which you can have hundreds of thousands of soulmates in a lifetime. Um, they're people that are basically sent in life to help you um, with person, place, or situation. They're not sexual in nature unless you make them. Sometimes soulmates turn into twin flames down the line because the people manifest it to make it that way in their life. Um, so I think for some of you guys, there it's coming in as soulmate energy. And for some of you guys, they're coming in as twin flame energy is what I'm thinking. Because I heard soulmate twin flame. So you take it how it resonates. But um, I heard for some of you guys, secrets are about to come out. And they're about to come out due to the soulmate or twin flame, however that resonates in your life, energy. However that person is progressed in your life at that this point in time. Um, because they're going to make it happen. Um so you take it out resonate. So 10 temporary situation. I think that's the secrets being temporary as of right now is what I'm thinking. Or it could be maybe this person, this soulmate or twin flame for some of you guys coming in and revealing these secrets. Maybe the bond deepens and it's a temporary situation in the relationship status. And maybe down the top, down the line, y'all's bond deepens and it becomes true twin flamey and y'all actually become a couple possibly. So that could be the temporary situation for some of you guys. You're taking all resonates. Wheel indecisiveness, allowing your life to ramble aimlessly. Someone is going to be very upset over these secrets of the past, but they are going to really channel their anger and turn it around in a very positive way for themselves, their love interest, and their family. Wow. Well, that's good, Leo. Holy crap. I heard someone's going to be very, very angry. So you're going to be very, very angry of these secrets of the past. You're going to be very angry. And apparently, a lot of these secrets involve you, I'm assuming, or somebody you really love and care about. Um, you take it out resonates. But I heard you're going to be very angry of these secrets. But once you learn them, um, I heard you're going to, you're really going to, be very angry, but you're going to channel your anger in a positive, healthy way. And you're going to basically turn it around and channel it um, in a positive way to help yourself, your love interest, and your family. So however you're going to turn it around and channel it. It could be legal action towards these people that have, maybe it might be criminal activity possibly for some of you guys. It might be legal action towards these people. It might be lawsuits. It might be getting cameras put up to protect yourself and your home and your family and your love interest. Um, you take it how it resonates, but you're going to turn the anger around in a positive, healthy way. Now, through its, whether it's through lawsuits or um, legal action or um, criminal, uh, you know, something of that nature, you're going to turn it around. You're not going to go around hullabaloo and screaming and yelling, acting all cray cray. That kind of thing is how I take that. But I think this is here because you're going to be so freaking angry when you learn these secrets. You're going to be very indecisive and you're going to be angry and you're going to have lots of emotions. But I heard you're going to turn around quickly. So that's good. The fool, which is fearlessness and freedom from a situation. So I think the fearlessness and freedom from a situation is a freedom from learning these horrible secrets of the past. Because um, there was a huge ass betrayal and there were secrets. But you're about to learn them for one particular person for a lot of you guys. But you're going to feel very free and fearless um, because you will, you'll be in the know and you will have the information you finally need for some of you guys to move forward. Whether it's legal action or um, criminal charges or um, cameras or, um, or just staying away from specific person, people, places, and situations because you have the knowledge now. You take it out resonates. You're going to feel very fear, uh, fearless and very free because you have learned all these betrayals and secrets and all this. December. For some, you became positions of authority in December. And you're going to help the, I mean, I'm sorry. This position is going to help you connect with other people to help you 
in a very positive way. Okay, wow, okay, that's great. Her, for some of you guys, you became in positions of authority in December, so I'm thinking December 2020 for some of you guys. And I heard this position is really gonna help you connect with other people, maybe other people in positions of a high authority to help you um, with this specific situation. So I think maybe to get out of these crazy wonky donkey secrets and betrayal and, and just moving away from toxicity and nastiness and you know moving yourself up in a positive, healthy, forward way um, for some of you guys. And I think that happened in December 2020, it looks like. Uh, for some of you guys, it could be December of um, 2019, possibly, or 2018. You take it out, resonates. Um, but I heard December 2020 in here for some of you guys. I heard, no, I heard December. I'm sorry. I heard December. I heard some of you guys became position of authority in December. So whether it's December 2020, 2019, 2018, however that resonates. But it's helping you um, connect with people like you, like you. So other people in high a high authority that can maybe get you connections to maybe help with this situation possibly is what i'm thinking for some of you guys and for some other people are heavy contemplatively thinking about contacting you soon for a position of high authority they really see your leadership and management skills. Okay. Well, I don't think that really goes with December part, but I'm just saying. Okay. So I heard, and other people, um, for some of you guys, other people are really considering um, contacting you, Leo, um, for, for you to have a position of authority because they really see your leadership and management skills. They're, they're heavy contemplative thinking on contacting you now. So we have the position of authority card. So maybe they've been heavy contemplating this since December for some of these guys, since December 2020. Because they see your heavy leadership and management skills. And they, they see it in you. And um, they want to offer you a, a position of authority. For some, it is extremely lucrative offers. As it should be. Wow. Her, for some of you guys, it's extremely lucrative offers as it should be. So I think some of the, for some of you guys, it's other people. I, you know, today's daily tea, I did a daily tea on basically somebody headhunting in a company looking for very skilled, qualified people um, to basically fix a hot mess express dumpster fire up in their workplace. Um, but they're basically headhunting. And there's one particular person in general in that reading. There are several people, but one particular person in general that they had seen that this person has proven it through time and experiences and um, situations that they were looking to headhunt, basically. So for some of you guys, it might you might be that person, possibly, but you take it out resonates. But I heard some of these guys, they've been really heavy contemplating since December of 2020. We're in February now. So they've been contemplating at least a couple months, I think, headhunting you scouting you um, for a management or leadership position. That's beautiful. This is overall looking pretty freaking great. I'm serious. And you know, I noticed last night, actually, I didn't mean to do it this way. It just kind of happened. Um, but, you know, the fixed signs, for anybody who doesn't know, I'm going to get you some literary witches oracle and then I'll pose it. The fixed signs are in the zodiac. Are Aquarius... Um, Leo, Scorpio, and, um, hold on, shoot, Aquarius, Leo, Scorpio, mm, 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 I know it, Aquarius, Leo, Scorpio, who's the other one I did the, because y'all are the fourth one I did the bonus on, who's the other one, um, mm, I would have a brain fart right now. There's four. Aquarius, Leo, Scorpio. There's a fourth. But my point is, um, and I will think of it probably when I've done this video. But I noticed today when I did Leo's that I've done all four of the fixed signs. I, I didn't mean to do it that way. I just did um, because those are the ones I felt guided to do um, too. It's not Sag. Um, who is the fourth fixed sign? 
Aquarius, Leo, Scorpio. It's not Gemini. Um, I can tell you the ones it's not. Skull. Lots of secrets are going to be revealed in a particular workplace situation and for some the beginning of a rela personal relationship. It's, the information flow is really going to help both of these situations. Okay. I heard um, lots of secrets are going to be revealed in a particular workplace situation. And for some, the beginning of a personal relationship is really going to help both of these situations. So we have the skull card, which is indicative of secrets. But I heard in this case, they're going to be revealed. In some, a workplace situation. In some, uh, the beginnings of a personal relationship, which is going to help the personal relationship grow because there will be no secrets um, at the beginning, which is beautiful. Um so you take it out resonates um now this could be uh, for some of you guys it could be your current workplace situation or it could be the those of you guys that are about to be headhunted so somebody's about to be headhunted to another um company um, because they know you do good work they know you're a wonderful employee they know you have leadership and management position um, for some of you guys it's a leadership and management position and i don't think it's over one or two people i think it's uh full-blown management leadership role like over several freaking people just saying um just for some of you guys but i heard uh, so however that resonates whether it's in your current workplace situation the new company that's going to reveal the hot mess express uh dumpster fire going on and somebody um that somebody wants to help come fix it or the current um or the personal relationship that's about to form for some of you guys um with the secrets being revealed of course that's gonna obviously help the relationship grow because there'll be no secrets there at the beginning which is wonderful story there will be lots of conversation in both of these situations okay i heard there will be lots of conversation in both these situations and many series of chain events in both. Okay, I heard there will be lots of conversation in both of these situations and many series of chain events. So the workplace, whether it's the new um, hedge, um, headhunter situation or the current workplace situation or the new personal relationship coming in for some of you guys. I heard that many series of chain of events is going to occur um, and conversations will happen in both of those. Devotion. Someone really sees a particular Leo's devotion and passion to their family, themselves, and their career. It's about to really pay off for one particular Leo. Wow, holy crap. I heard someone really sees the devotion in one particular Leo to their family, themselves, and their career. And it's about to really pay off for one particular Leo. That's beautiful. And someone is really going to become very devoted to one particular leo in the personal relationship department and it will be returned to them tenfold holy crap this is looking great holy crap leo i heard somebody is about to get wonderful blessings and i'm just for real for real wonderful freaking blessings i i just don't even know how to say that how else to say it but I heard somebody's about to become very devoted to one particular Leo. So they um, they can see their life. I think they can see their life with this Leo. They, or they want to spend their life with this Leo. And they're about to come and tell them. I really, I think it's this person. They're about to come tell them. They're about to come. They are about to come clean, 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 clean. In a very pure of heart kind of way, they're going to reveal all the secrets. They're going to, I mean, they're going to reveal their soul. I mean, they are going to lay it out on the line is what it looks like. Um, 
And I heard it's going to be returned to them tenfold, tenfold. So I think the Leo, you you are going to really appreciate this about this person. You're really going to appreciate this because, you know, Leos are usually very, very devoted, usually. Um, if they can sense true devotion, no, I'm not saying all of us are like this because, you know, you make your own decisions. Everybody has free will. You can be a Leo, sun, moon, rising, Venus, North Dakota, Midheaven, and be the shystiest person known to man. That's just the truth. Or you can really be. But tend to... Our signs usually equate us to be very devoted and loyal. And a lot of us are. But it's really in how you manifest yourself, too. We all know that. Um, but for who this resonates with, I think you really are. You truly are devoted. You truly are loyal. And this person sees this. They see this. So they want to be this way to you. Um, and I heard you're going to return it to them tenfold. So obviously you are very loyal and very devoted. And you're, you're about to. For who this resonates with. This is freaking a beautiful. We have devotion card. This is looking so freaking great. Just saying. Let me see if I hear anything else. <clears throat> there will be big positive changes here. Soon. Okay, I heard there will be big positive changes here soon. So somebody's about to have some big positive changes. Lots of truth, lots of clarity. Um, where at one time it looks like there was not lots of the truth and clarity, but there is a, somebody is about to get a world of information overload almost uh, of truth and clarity, which is wonderful for your... That's good for work life and personal life, um, bar none. So that's great. That's for somebody out there. All right, you guys, we're done, 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 done. Excuse me. Personal readings currently closed. However, donations super duper greatly appreciated. Cypress so Citro 5, the links in the description box below. Um, the only thing I ask with this is um, uh, if you decide to donate, because it's still donations only, even though I'm um, 10 days out with no pay because I refused the COVID vaccine. I'm still giving it donations only. So if you'd like to donate, you have to go through my PayPal. But there will be a drop down after you select your donation amount. So you have to clear it out and put in donation. Very important. All right, you guys. I love you guys so freaking much. If you wouldn't mind sharing these videos and sharing word of mouth, I'd appreciate it. Love you guys so much. Make good choices. Namaste.